Hello guys, welcome back. This is the part 14 of JWT authentication. In this tutorial, we are going to implement change password. So let's get started. First of all, let's go to terminal and new terminal. Let's navigate to client project and let's generate change password component inside pages. So ng g c pages inside pages. Let's add change password and skip test. Change password component generated. So let's go to app route ts and here let's duplicate it and let's rename this change password and make it change password here we need to authorize so only login user can access this page so let's it can active and auth card let's go to navbar component and here let's duplicate it and rename this change password add here router link router link let's make it change password let's make it password and rename this and rename this one change password save it go to terminal and npm start and let's run our backend application go to api project and run .net was run let's go to browser and login login success let's go to user and go to change password we can see change password work let's design our form let's go to reset password component html and copy these things go and go to change password paste it and here add forms module and go to component html and make it change password here current password let's make it current password here and new password let's make it new password and disable here current password and if we don't have new password here we need to disable our button let's remove this one and rename this change password let's rename this one change password go to component and here new password of type string current password of type string and let's inject auth service and mat snack bar let's Im let's import her mat snack bar model and inject router and add change password in component ts let's save it and restart our application go to browser let's take a look we have beautiful design form here now let's implement api for change password go to account controller and here let's add http post method let's say public async task of action result and here let's rename this password change password let's bind here change password dtu let's create this dtu inside dtu's folder new class let's add property here prop tab string email string dot empty let's enter it with required this is required field and type email address let's add another field prop tab string and we need current password string dot empty and let's make it required and add another property prop tab string 
new password let's make it required string dot empty save it here let's implement our change password method let's find user by their email for user away user manager find by email async let's pass their email change the password dtu dot change password let's make it change password dtu dot email if user is not then return Fed request and let's pass a new auth response. Did you pass here a success false and message user email? If we have user, then let's change our password here. Bar result await user manager dot change password async. This method take three argument user change password dot current password and another one is change password did you dot new password if result dot succeed then return ok and pass a new auth response did you is success true and message let's pass a password change successfully close it and save it let's close it and go to auth service let's implement here change password method let's duplicate it and make it change password let's rename this change password request copy this one and let's create interface here in file change password request ts let's add here interface export interface change password request and add here email of type string new password of type string and current password of type string save it let's import this one control dot control dot and import let's rename this change password save it go to change password component ts and let's implement here let's call this dot auth service dot change password let's pass a object let's pass an email this dot auth service dot get user detail and email let's pass new password of type this new password this dot new password and current password this dot current password and subscribe next response let's display her toast notification if response dot success then let's show toast notification snack bar dot open response dot message and close and let's add her duration and let's log out our application this is our service dot log out and redirect it to login again this dot router dot navigate to login okay otherwise if you don't have success response then let's copy this one and display error message let's handle here error 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 goes to error error response let's display to post notification here paste it and error dot message error dot error dot message Save it account controller and return here return bad request let's copy this one paste here and let's pass here this return result dot error dot first or default and their description 
save it go to browser let's log in our application and here let's go to change password let's go to change password component html and remove read only let's add here placeholder current password and here new password and let's make it type password save it go to browser and enter your current password and test and your new password let's click change password we have 404 that means we don't have in point go to account controller and let's do let's add here change password save it browser let's try again let's click change password we have 200 success and navigate it to login page let's login our new password let's click it now we have changed our password successfully 